Hello children, today we shall learn about safety. If someday you are late from home while coming back from school, your mother becomes worried. Sometimes she even starts calling your friends to know why you are late. She is worried about your safety because she loves you. Few kids may say there is no reason to be worried about their safety. So what is safety? Safety means staying away from harm. And we often hear about unfortunate incidents in which people get hurt. Like a boy was running in the middle of the road. He was playing something. A cycle could have hit him, but he had a narrow escape. We can get hurt whenever we come in way of a moving vehicle. Now you know why your mother worries about you when you are on road. No one likes to get hurt as it is painful. So remember a simple thing. Don't get in way of a moving vehicle. Always walk on the footpath on the side of the road. Footpath is a narrow path beside road which people use to walk safely because vehicle don't use the footpath. But don't run on the footpath. You may fall down and get hurt. If footpath is not there, walk on the side of the road. Look what happened. This boy slipped on a banana peel. Who threw it? This is the reason why we should keep our eyes on the road as well as keep it clean. If you throw a banana peel or litter the road, this can happen to your friend or even yourself. Now what if you need to cross the road to reach the home? Your mother always tells you to be careful when crossing the road because this is the time when you may come in the way of a moving vehicle. So when is the right time to cross the road? You must have seen the traffic lights on the road crossings. These traffic lights on the roads tell the vehicles to stop or go. Red light tells the vehicles to stop. Top. Yellow light tells the vehicles to be ready and the green light tells the vehicle to go. Have you seen the black and white lines drawn across the road where people are crossing the road? What are these? It's a zebra crossing as the lines looks like the lines of the zebra. It is a special path for crossing the road by the people who are walking that is pedestrians. You can cross the road with other elder people using zebra crossing for more safety. But you can cross the road using zebra crossing when cars coming in your way are stopped by the traffic light. That is, the traffic light is red. But in some places, there are no traffic signal. That time, maybe a traffic policeman will guide you. Also in such places, you may see many elder people gathered to cross the road. Just join them when they cross the road as they are well experienced in crossing the road. When crossing road in such places, make a habit of looking right, then left, then right again to make sure no vehicle is coming. because. You will grow up soon and this habit will help you to cross the road alone with safety then. We are talking about walking on the road. But few kids board a bus to go to the school and return home. Does that mean they don't need to know about the safety rules? No, they do. I am sure you may have seen few people trying to get into the moving vehicle or trying to get 
down from the moving vehicle but if may fall on the road and get hurt very badly so never try to board a bus or get down from it when it is moving it is a very bad idea when boarding a bus stand in a queue if you try to push others while boarding bus or getting down from the bus it will just cause trouble and you or someone else may get hurt if you put your head or hand out of moving bus some elder people around you may scold you because you may hurt yourself this way you may get hit by a moving vehicle so you must have understood why your mother worries about you if you are late by the way if you ride bicycle don't hurry to return home big trucks car run on the road so try to ride your bicycle carefully on the side of the road not in the middle accidents are unfortunate incident which occurs unexpectedly and suddenly but if you stay alert and follow few things you will be safer and your mother would be less worried about you so follow these little things and the next time when your mother becomes worried about you you can say mother don't worry i know my safety i follow all the rules so be safe and enjoy your journey on the road that is all for today children bye bye